the proudest blue. Mama holds out the pink. Mama loves pink. But Asia shakes her head. I know why. Behind the counter is the brightest blue, the colour of the ocean. If you squint your eyes and pretend there's no line between the water and the sky. It's the first day hijab. Asia knows it. I know it. We're sisters. The next day I wait. A new backpack, a new light up shoes. I feel special. I feel like twirling. Asia comes out of the house and I stop. It's the most beautiful first day of school ever. I'm walking with a princess, so I pretend I'm one too. But even princesses have to stop to cross the street. Asia takes my hand in hers, says, Come on, Faiza, we speed walk it. 14 steps, 14 light ups to get across. Asia takes me to my class first, hugs me goodbye. I turn to watch her leave, give a little curtsy to the princess going to the year seven area. She's easy to see. Her hijab smiles at me the whole way. My first day hijab is going to be blue too. What's that on your sister's head? The girl in front of me whispers. A scarf, I whisper back. I don't know why a whisper came out. I try again louder now. A scarf, hijab. Oh, she whispers. Asia's hijab isn't a whisper. Asia's hijab is like the sky on a sunny day. The sky isn't a whisper. It's always there, special and normal. The first day of wearing hijab is important, Mama had said. It means being strong. I turn, but I can't see the blue anymore. I run to the big kid's side, 27 steps to see Asia. I need to give her another hug. I need to see her smile. Faiza, Asia's eyes wonder why I'm here. Are you excited? I ask, about the first day of a job? She nods with a big smile and I feel better. Someone laughs from nearby, a boy pointing at Asia. Why? Asia's hijab isn't a laugh. Asia's hijab is like the ocean waving to the sky. It's always there, strong and friendly. Some people won't understand your hijab, Mama had said. But if you understand who you are, one day they will too. In class, I draw a picture. Two princesses in a hijab having a picnic on an island where the ocean meets the sky. The girl who whispered in the queue says she likes it. She says it so loud. The teacher comes over to see it. I wonder if Asia drew a picture too. Break time is for five cartwheels in a row. I land the last one near the year sevens near Asia and her friends, near a boy yelling, I'm going to pull that tablecloth off your head. Hmm. Asia's hijab isn't a tablecloth. Asia's hijab is blue, only blue. Asia turns away, her friends turn away. They race to the middle of the playground, their shoes pounding the pavement, playing tag. Mama, don't carry the words of others around. Drop them. They're not yours to keep. They belong only to those who said them. It takes me 48 steps to get away from the yelling boy. After school, I look around. I look for whispers, laughs and shouts. But I only see Asia waiting for me like it's a normal day. She's smiling, strong. We cross the road, hand in hand. I can't wait to get home to show Mama the picture I drew, to show Asia that I'm wearing the same hijab in it. 
Because Arsia's hijab is like the ocean and the sky, no line between them, saying hello with a loud wave. Saying, I'll always be here like sisters, like me and Arsia.